Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. What is up you guys welcome back to another video in today's video i am showing you guys basically what i use and um what i do for my period hygiene just showing you guys also how i relax on my first day all right so the first thing i am putting in the water is the dr tills foaming bath with epsom salt this is so soothing and so relaxing and then of course you gotta add the um dr tears pure epsom soaking salt as well and then i am also adding in a bath bomb These are also the products I will be using today um, to bathe with. And then I am now just um, lighting a couple of candles. Y'all see that bump on my chest? I really hate when my cycle comes on because that, that's the only time that my skin breaks out. I am now um, dry brushing my skin. This is my first time doing this um, since I read up on it. So I'm um, sorry if I am doing it wrong. I just honestly don't know how to do it good as of yet. Um, but I will list the benefits in the description box below of dry brushing. Alright, so I am now getting in. The first thing I am doing is putting my hair up and then I will be taking my robe off. Alright, so it's now time for me to get out. Um, the bubbles wasn't bubbling anymore how they was in the water was getting cold so um i am just taking the candles out and then after i am done doing that i will get in the shower So if you want to know what I use um, for my shower routine and also what I do, the both of the videos that I have recorded already will be down in the description box below. Alright, so I'm currently now out of the shower and um, I know I told you guys I started using the Cetaphil, but I also picked this up at Walmart today. Um, it is for hyper skin pigmentation. You guys know I have spoken on that previously in another video. Y'all, look how slow this comes out. And I think it comes out like that, of course, since it is a thick consistency. Um, so when rubbing it in, it feels so good on my hand. It actually feels like the Dove Exfoliator. Y'all know I love that. That body polish I use. Um, so it feels really good on my face. So these are the pads that I use, the Always Maxi. Um, the thing about these is I usually get the ones with the wings. I did not realize I grabbed the ones without wings. So I'll be glad when I run out of those. I am now blowing out the candles and I'm grabbing the products that I use for moisture. If you haven't seen my shower routine, definitely go check that out. So I am now in my room and this is what I have on. I have on a comfy shirt and some boxers and I feel so comfortable right now. So I did purchase this um, comforter set before I came home and I am just about to go ahead and make my bed. I'm now lighting the 
candle in my room as well and I am about to eat. I got a salad and some water. So the reason why I'm eating a salad is because when I'm on my cycle, I really don't have the energy to eat. Um, I don't have the appetite to eat. So I feel like eating something light for me is always good. Um, like the first day of my cycle because I literally, y'all, I have no appetite. So I'm also taking some Tylenol too because they help with the cramps. I'm not too big on medicine. So Tylenol is the only thing that I will take for pain regardless if it helps or not. So after eating, I am about to go ahead and fix me some tea. I feel like I'm always putting you guys on different tea that I uh, drink, but I did choose the chamomile, calm chamomile tazo tea. Um, Y'all, this is my first time using it, but I heard that chamomile... Um, helps while you're on your cycle because of the fatigue and it, it helps you sleep better and that's exactly what I need right now like I toss and turn so much like when I sleep so I am just getting some comfort snacks I did eat some Oreos while I was making the tea and then I am also eating Kit Kats and drinking the tea and um journaling is not a part of my sorry planning is not a part of my peer routine but i did start it earlier so this is something that i want to go ahead and finish and so i'm now eating that kit kat y'all and i could literally not put it down the tea was good my first time drinking and then it's kit kat too like where does it end I'm back in my room straightening up and y'all that is the wrap for this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and your girl is out let no one come and take your place cause the love you give you can't be replaced